Hi, today we're gonna to talk about the brand new Browning X-Bolt 2. This model here is the Speed SPR in Ovix. We had the opportunity to take this Browning X-Bolt 2 into the field a little early and give it a try. Aubrey took out the X-Bolt 2 right here at home in Colorado on a mule deer hunt. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. And I also had the opportunity to take it down to Alabama on a whitetail hunt. What a beautiful, beautiful buck. He's got good mass. Yeah. A beautiful nine, a beautiful nine point. We have been shooting Browning rifles for quite a while now. And this new X-Bolt II has really been one of our new favorite guns now. I wanna go over some of the specs with you so you can understand what's new about the X-Bolt II. The new Browning X-Bolt II has a reconfigured receiver with additional bolt guidance surface area for smoother operation. Also, they redesigned the bolt with an ergonomic new handle shape. So what we're saying is on this new X-Bolt II is they redesigned the bolt area with longer surface area. It's gonna go in smoother and they also redesigned the bolt handle itself so it fits better in your hand. The X-Bolt II has an adjustable multi-lever DLX trigger set to hunting weights. And that means that it's adjustable to your preference whether you want a harder pull or a softer pull on the trigger. The Browning X-Bolt II with the new very tech stock with Ovix camouflage features adjustable length of pole, adjustable comb, interchangeable grip modules, and over-molded grip surfaces. The new Veritech stock is basically a modular system. It's gonna go ahead and make it so that you can make it customizable to how you feel most comfortable to shoot this rifle. You can go ahead and lengthen the stock back here. This is a cheek plate. You can raise it up so you can go ahead and feel comfortable where, where it's sitting on your cheek. There's two different grips to put in. So you can go ahead and decide which grip feels the most comfortable to you while you're shooting, as well as extra molded places on the gun for better gripping while you're hunting or shooting. It also has a smoked bronze Cerakote finish, which protects better than traditional bluing. What it is, is it's a better protection for your barrel than the traditional bluing. So whether you're out in the elements, you're walking through brush, whatever it is that you're doing with your firearm, with your rifle, it's gonna protect your firearm better. It has a four inch shorter barrel length, optimized for use with a suppressor. This X-Bolt Speed SPR means suppressor ready. The barrel length itself is four inches shorter, so you can go ahead and we can put our Griffin suppressor on there and still have a decent length firearm. And lastly, it comes with a fluted sporter contour barrel with a radial muzzle brake. This barrel design on the X-Bolt II is gonna go ahead and it's gonna make it a little bit lighter weight, and it's also going to go ahead and make your barrel cool down quicker after multiple shots. The new Browning X-Bolt II is gonna come in these calipers, 243, 6.5 Creedmoor, 308, 6.5 PRC, 6.8 Western, 270, 30 odd six, 7 mm, 7 PRC, 300, and 300 PRC. I don't know all the extra options that these guns come with. I know when I go ahead and put my cheek on the cheek rest and I squeeze that trigger, what the reaction is that I want from it. This new Browning X-Bolt II Speed SPR has been a great gun for my interest and in what I do with it. Now, RJ, on the other hand, he knows exactly what all of those things that I just read off and said to you guys, exactly what it all does. But honestly, it is a great shooting gun in the field, on the range. It's just all around together. It's lighter weight. The adjustable cheek stock here, I did enjoy. I did went ahead and moved it up and around to where it sat just right where I needed it to. It's a great new gun, the new X-Bolt II. Go to your local gun shops, check them out. I think you guys are gonna like this one.